In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to insert a table into Yahoo Mail, whether you need to share data professionally, or just want to make your email visually engaging, incorporating tables effectively can really enhance your message. Let's get started with this straightforward process, and by the end, you'll have all the tools you need to do it seamlessly. First, you'll want to start by opening up a spreadsheet tool. You might use Microsoft Excel, Google Sheets, or any other application you're comfortable with. These tools offer flexible environments for creating and editing tables that can be copied into your email. Once you've chosen your tool, go ahead and create a table with all the necessary rows and columns that adequately fit the information you wish to share. You can style it however you like, but remember, the clearer and more concise your data presentation is, the more helpful it will be to the person receiving your email. Next, you'll need to highlight the entire table. You can do this by simply clicking and dragging your cursor over the table data. Once it's all selected, copy the table using the keyboard shortcut Control plus C, or if you're using a Mac, CMD plus C. Now, open Yahoo Mail and prepare to log into your account. Type in your Yahoo email address when prompted on the login page. After you've entered your email address, click Next to proceed. You'll then be required to input your password. Once that's done, click on Next again to gain access to your email account. When you're in, you'll need to open a new Compose window. This is where you'll paste your table. The Compose button usually looks like a pencil, and you can find it in the top left corner of your screen. Once the Compose window is open, click into the body of the email. It's time to paste the table you've copied earlier. Use the keyboard shortcut Ctrl plus V or CMD plus V if you're on a Mac to paste the table directly into your email. At this point, you might want to verify that all of the data is visible and formatted as you expect. Keep in mind, while this method works in most cases, formatting may sometimes vary slightly based on the original document. If you've set up any specific styles or colours, ensure they've all come through correctly. Overall, these steps make it straightforward to include tables in your Yahoo Mail messages, so take advantage and give your emails a new level of sophistication. With practice, you'll master this in no time. Thanks for watching and happy emailing!